So we are finally back and attempting to get Dandelion rescued after, I don't know, 25, 26 episodes or so? Uh, we have hatched a plan to bring the Doppler out of hiding by putting on a play that will let Doo-Doo, Doo-Doo, yes, Doo-Doo, know that we want to bring him and have him um, join us. But to do that, we need to get this play to Arena. Who I guess has a say in if it will be approved or not. Look awfully suspicious to me, Trap. Where are you going? That's a place of culture. This where Madame Arena's troop performs. Yeah. But you can only enter with a ticket. There's no performance now. Mamas are just rehearsing. The process is interesting to observe, though. So, want a ticket? No performance. Said so yourself. You can still get a ticket. What'll it be? Need a ticket. <laughs> so welcome back, everybody, to Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I am Athenon, and let's get back into it. Yeah, I'll get a ticket. Yeah. Peace, Louise. Here. Just stay out of sight, eh? Awful bashful, these mamas in rehearsal. Okay, so now he'll let us in. And I'm gonna take your stuff because you were a jerk to me. Moly, moly, you're a swell one. What was wrong that time? Madam Arena, can we talk? Geralt of Rivia. Dandelions told us so much about you. Is he with you? No, but I hope to bring him back soon. Here to talk about Dudu. Hmm. <laughs> Let's speak in my quarters at the back of the theater. We'll be undisturbed there. What do you want to bet she's Dudu? She'd be like, well, I'm Dudu. How can I help? We've not seen Dandelion or Dudu recently. Uh. Dandelion okay, maybe she's trying. not. <laughs> that much I guessed. Though, I am curious how serious it is. Did he seduce a powerful man's wife and go into hiding? Or did he write an offensive couplet about the priests of the Eternal Fire? Worse. Lots. I'm gonna try to help him. Gotta contact Dudu first. But he's disappeared as well. Have a plan to lure him out of hiding, but I need your help. Can I count on you? Naturally, but what can we possibly do? I'd like to put on a play. I want to stage a play, something that'll really draw the crowds. I see. And you hope it'll get Dudu's attention as well, draw him here. So it must be an entirely new play? And who will write it? Priscilla, actually. She's done writing it. Tells the story of a witcher who rescues a Doppler from certain death. Mm. Sounds interesting. I'll gladly have a glance. But first we must think about getting the word out and organizing some protection. Ushers, would you mind tending to these matters? Why ushers? Think we need ushers? A play about Dopplers could be controversial, but are ushers absolutely necessary? Can't be sure if you've attended many performances, but Novigrad crowds can be particularly difficult. Rotten apples, tomatoes, eggs, that sort of thing? Axes, butcher's knives, and bricks, actually. Dang! All right, know <laughs> anyone appropriate? Tough to be an actor. Try the docks, perhaps. You're bound to find some men willing to do any work for a few crowns. How do I how do I help how can I help you spread the word about the premiere? Well, we'd like all the city to hear about it, so we must clearly talk to the puffins. Who are the, who? the puffins? <laughs> Street artists. Get them to announce the premiere, and even the muscles on the harbor piling will hear about it. Where'll I find them? They did occupy some rooms in the bits in a townhouse. But I can't be sure they're still there. I've not seen them in the streets lately. They may very well have hung up their body hose. Let's see if I can find them, and if they'll work for us. Thanks. Thanks for helping. I'll come back once I've found some ushers. See you then. All right, so head to the docks. So I need to recruit the... I can opti optionally recruit the jugglers. Oh, 
I've worked up quite the appetite. All right, so let's see where it's taking me to. So that's the that's where the jugglers are. Let's go. Let's go recruit the jugglers and see what happens there. Unorthodox books, what? Unorthodox books? Why would anybody have any of those? You're crazy. There's the house of love. The house of easy women. <laughs> well, they aren't easy. They're just, you can buy, you can, you know, buy a, buy a back massage for a few hours. You know what I'm saying? I really haven't run around a lot in, in Novigrad. It's kind of cool to see it at night when all the fun stuff is out. What is that out in the, out in the water? Good fight. Some nice footwork there. Challenging me, or is it hell you want to face? A witcher versus the beast of Metina. Killer instinct versus pride. Why am I here? I'd like to hire you to help out. We're staging a play. Need us to kick some ass on stage. Actually want you to usher. Keep the peace. Make sure no one's ass gets kicked on stage or off. Got the wrong man. Ass kicking's what we do. I pay well. Stand to make more than you do here. Expecting trouble, but we need to bust some heads. Can't rule it out. Bricks could start flying. <laughs> that from a reliable source. Now, wanna smash some brick layers? <laughs> oh, he does, he does. Oh, I don't know me, I'm brother. Huh? Give me that coin. And don't fret. We'll be there before any of the uh, dancing starts. All right. No, why, why did I thought I had clicked on the jugglers? Oh. I'm okay. I did. I was following the quest. I was following the quest thing. I wasn't following the. Uh, um. I wasn't following the uh, the green marker that I set for myself. Wow, it is really, it is really stormy. We're just gonna chill out here on the dock until morning. And people are like, why is this guy just sitting on the dock for hours on end? What the hell is he doing? Don't worry about me. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine, everybody. It's going to be just fine. All right. I want to get the mummers involved because if we get the jugglers going on it, they'll have to spread the word. You know what I'm saying? Run by guys, they go rah. Makes you feel like you're doing something really worthwhile. They like stealing our work, those Tamarians. Eternal fire protects us, gives monsters the shits. Well, save me. What do you see, Kaylee? Wait a second, is this front door here? Nope. Hey, I'm not a mutant. Well, yeah, I guess I sort of am.
Oh, there they, there's the door. I thought it was just a window. Nice tune. Damn sad, though. Then it successfully conveys my mood. What do you seek here? <laughs> I just walked in. <laughs> Looking for the puffins. Have I found them? We've no coin. Leave us be. Think there's been a mistake. Sorry. Thought our landlord had hired another thug to collect from us. Don't want any coin from you. In fact, I'm willing to pay you, provided you agree to get the word out about Madame Arena's new play. Oh, afraid that's impossible. Ever since we premiered our fateful ballad about Holy Hemelfart, who his faith ignores, gorges himself, diddles old whores, Fatso's gang has been harassing us incessantly. Fatso's gang? Common thugs and the church's pay. City's full of gangs like that now. They threatened me, sir. Said they round off her pointy ears with a carving knife. They don't let us perform. Chase away spectators, destroy our instruments. Lately they've taken to lurking outside our home. We're at wit's end, no clue what to do. Yeah, I'll take care of him. All right. Say I get Fatso and his boys to leave you alone. Will you publicize Arena's play? <laughs> Another then? quest of within course, a quest within a quest. But you shan't find it easy. There's no talking to that lot. No, I'm not gonna I'm talk not to him. I'm a great talker anyway. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Ah, miserable. Oh, dare you to say hungry. it again? I, I didn't say nothing. Not enough, he's a heretic, he's all... Hello. So you're the ones. Oh, right, fat so, look who we got here. Is it just me, or you got cat eyes? Right, he does. Stray cat must have fucked his mum. <laughs> now, what you doing in the city of eternal fire, cat shit? Yeah, leave leave him, the puffins alone. Worms that insulted our Ark Emelfart, called him an allmonger. I'd sooner snuff out the holy flame itself. Tell them fucking poets to come down here. Shove their fruits up their blaspheming assholes. Yeah, to play a different tune then, every time they fought. <laughs> Leave the puffins alone. Aye, we will. <laughs> alone. It's nice having that up there. It Black saves a lot of fight. He's a fucking witch. Get him! Oh, it didn't stop me this time. What a sight! You really showed them. One, two over the back, then pow, right in the noggin. <laughs> I'll finally be able to leave my home without hiding beneath a hood. Thank you very much. Come on, it was nothing. Oh, it was something, all right. <laughs> I don't dare think we've forgotten our promise. We'll strip our voices ragged praising Arena's new play. How much will I owe you? Not a copper. Helped us out. See no reason why we shouldn't help you. Get half of town to come to the play. Wait and see. Some quick preparations and we'll be out in the streets. <laughs> Till the next. Oh, okay. They didn't even charge me. That's nice. Awesome. That guy's drunk. Oh, my strength's gone. My strength's gone. All right, let's go talk to Arena about the new play. Sons, man. How y'all doing? Uh, youth these days, they're brained, all of them. So, how do you go with this thing? I was laughing about my <laughs> when suddenly found some of Horse Sun Jr.'s men. Fuck off, bitch! Doppler belongs in the fire! You like the bands are snapping the mud from the working man. Well, let's get this play it's underway. I am not a freak. Jeez. Ah, there you are. Everybody's so mean. Everybody's nice so judgy. Mushers. 
Wonderful. That's one matter resolved. Wanted to talk about the text itself. Hmm. It's not at all badly written. In fact, I quite like it. I was willing to relax my standards to help Dudu, but we may have something very interesting here. I've very clear ideas who to cast as the servant, the witcher, and the queen, but I'm not certain who should play the prince and the princess. Who's gonna play Who's the witcher? playing the witcher? An amateur. It'll be my first time working with him, but I'm confident he'll pull it off. Newcomer to the troop? In a sense. Oh, stop pretending you don't know. I'm talking about you. Ah! <laughs> Might not have noticed, but I'm a little low on emotional expression. But that's perfect. After all, you're to play the Witcher, not the Princess. Uh, jeez, always. Besides, you must appear on stage. Dudu must see you. It's the crux of this entire endeavor. You're right. Just never thought I'd have to do something like this. You'll be fine, dear. You need only strut on stage, great sword in hand, furl your brow, make some threatening faces, then deliver a few lines in a gravelly voice. Think you can manage? Gravelly voice? Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> so, about the princess. Small part, but an important one. Any idea who could play her? Priscilla would be the obvious choice. She's young and beautiful. Yet, I do have more stage experience. Roll's yours. Talent and experience Trump looks in my book. I'm honored. I shall give it my all. So who do you see playing the Doppler Prince? I'm finding it hard to decide between two candidates. Abelard Ritzer would be the safer bet. He's been part of our troop for ages, has flawless technique, but he doesn't exactly captivate the crowd. Okay, so who else? What's your other option? Maxim Bolia. Outstanding actor, and audiences love him. But sadly, I can never be sure he'll show up sober, or that he'll show up at all. Now then, take the other guy. Let's go with Abelard. I'll take a reliable artisan over an unpredictable artist any day. Rightly so. The project is risky enough without our casting Maxim. I gave her the role because, you know, hey. I felt like being nice to her. <laughs> These performances bring in much coin? Well, it varies. On good days, the square is barely capable of accommodating everyone. Other times, we're lucky to earn a handful of coppers. Of course, we shall pay you a fee as well. You're a member of the ensemble now. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> All right. Got the cast figured out. It seems so. Prepared to plunge headlong into your career as a mama? Start now. Looked over the script out of curiosity. We can start any time, even now. Well, we've no time to lose. Come to the stage. Zoltan, what are you doing here? <laughs> Pessy told me you ought to put on a play. Were you playing the lead? I'm not the lead. Oh, I thought to myself, I'd sooner shave my beard than miss that. <laughs> Tell me what you are. You're going to wear hose and a codpiece. Come, Geralt, you must focus your mind before you go on stage. Good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, most honorable citizens of the hallowed city of Novigrad, welcome. Welcome. We have for you an exquisite comedy. Its title, The Doppler's Salvation. The players, Witcher Geralt as himself, Katarina as the queen, Leo Rybe as the humble servant, appearing as the prince, a veteran of the Novigrad stage, Abelard Ritza. And as the princess, renowned artiste, beloved queen of the stage, Irina Reynard! Oh, 
All right, here we go. Let's see what we do. People seem excited. Majesty, the monster slayer awaits. Your summons he's answered and stands at the gates. Show him in. I must speak to the man. But first, some wine to steady my hand. Witcher, your task is a matter most tender. A monster shall show at tonight's beastly splendor. Stand guard, beware. Kill the beast if he shows. Your reward you'll receive on my finest pillows. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, to slay beasts most foul, twas for this I was made. I kill as my calling, not just to get paid. Okay. He swallowed the bait, this fool of a witcher. I'll ensure the foul bow reveals his true figure. The monster revealed, the witcher shall strike. The beast will he slay, thrust his head on a pike. Oh, my child will pity her love, this beast. Though at least ere he goes, he'll enjoy a last feast. Okay. Gathered are we, a host fair and noble, to celebrate this day the princess's betrothal. Alas, no monster do I see or hear. Um, I guess. I don't know which Perhaps one to choose. The guest hides <laughs> in fear. Maybe it doesn't matter. That kid looks scared. My dear, long have we hid our love's tender fires. Months we've restrained our loins' hot desires. <laughs> Tonight shall it end. Be my wife. That's my plea. That having said, <laughs> I'll get down on my knee. Oh, darling. I will, I will, I will. Wait, with wine must we toast this moment joyful. If not, a foul curse shall rend your lives woeful. T -t 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 Treason! Tis not wine, but a brew spiked with silver. My bowels contract a foul beast to deliver. Hark, hark. Tis no prince, but a Doppler imposter. Oh, whoa. <laughs> uh, okay, I... <laughs> See as men's hearts can love. Well, let's choose one. Foster. Behold, Witcher, the beast of which I spoke. Unleash your sword. Let fly the killing stroke. Stop. Stop. Beast or man, tis my love. My betrothed. Sheath your blades, fear a Doppler. Tis a thing most foolish. Changing one's shape does not make one ghoulish. Remember, tis not flesh a monster makes. Okay. But a heart that is base, such as in this knave aches. Witcher, tis true. This wretch is foul suspicions. I hope this, I hope this doesn't this screw anything up. I should have read the lines. The Doppler must live. My daughter he'll wed. Beast or man, she loves him truly without dread. Tis our tale's end, good folk. And its moral is this. No love. We'll go with the first one, I guess. No monster. Seems to go back and forth. Can shift. The Witcher is just a true Doppler's friend. But you, foul page, in chains you shall end. God, call the guard. Remove the traitor at once. Hey, hear the princess's command. Come up here. Come on then, governor. Up you go. On stage. 
Toss the tray, I scum in the dungeon! Okay, is he the Don't Doppler? Be afraid. In the end, everyone will live happily ever after. Doppler and Princess wed the same night. The servant's heart melted. He wept at the sight. Okay. Doppler's to the stake! Burn them all! Give it a rest, mate. Can't you see it's all in fun? This is a comedy. A ghoul could play the prince. Lighten up, for God's sake. <laughs> oh, is the kitty cat the Doppler? <laughs> There's a kitty cat up there. Is that the Doppler? I don't know. Well, we must have done something right. Geralt, you recognize me. How'd you do it? Greetings, Dudu. Heard about that souvenir Horson left on your face. So, you know everything? Have you seen Siri? No. We Still must have done it right. Awesome. Geralt, masterful. You did great. Haven't they laughed that hard in ages? Lads won't believe it when I tell them. Explain one thing to me. How do you and Dandelion manage to displease Reuven, Horson, and the Temple Guard all at the same time? It's not as if we planned it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you didn't get contact Why Priscilla. Why? Priscilla or the Mummers contact them. I came to a few performances, different shape each time, but I dared not show myself. Feared I'd put them at risk. Then, I got word of a new mummy. Saw it as my chance to learn something, anything, about Siri and Dandelion. I know Siri went back to Horsens to get you. How'd you manage to escape? I ran after her, wanting to keep up, but I'd have been a hindrance. She called out to me, entreated me to shapeshift and disappear. I tried to find them, Siri and Dandelion. It was as if they turned to vapor. Fearing for my life, I shifted each day, becoming someone else. Even considered turning into Siri to trick her pursuers, but hold on, Marmalade. Geralt, when did you last see Cirilla? Hmm? Been a while, hasn't it? A while, yeah. For me, likewise. Must be a full grown lass by now. Do 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 us a wee favor. Show us Siri for a moment. Geralt? <laughs> <laughs> This should be interesting. Transform. Change into her. I feel strange. Both of you staring at me bug-eyed. <laughs> Is that enough? You ain't a little kid anymore. Yeah. Plenty. Bad idea. Not angry with me, are you, Geralt? No. I feel relieved. And Dandelion? Were you able to find him? Witch hunters nabbed him, but there's good news too. Menga's dead. Ugh, a fiend. Good thing someone finally killed it, though another, just as bad or worse, would likely take its place. Wouldn't be so quick to assume. Got a feeling it could be a decent fellow. What's he talking about? We think we can free Dandelion. Just need your help. What could I do? Take on Menga's appearance, then go and give the order for Dandelion to be moved to Oxenfurt. We'll lie in ambush in a ravine en route. Spring Dandelion from the convoy when it rolls by. Wait, not so fast. How am I to be Menga? And I've no notion where Dandelion's being held. Dandelion's on Temple Isle, imprisoned there. We know all we this stuff. Out exactly where. But what if they grow suspicious? Start asking questions. I'll bet my best axe no one will pester the commander of the Temple Guard. 
Besides, you're a Doppler and an actor, and an actor and a Doppler. Got double the spark to improvise your way out of any situation. If things get spicy, you'll just nip round the corner and transform into a buxom wench, a, a jackdaw, or whatever else strikes your fancy. Of course, it's that simple. Thanks. No one knows Menga's dead. No need to worry about being exposed. No one save you. Would this have anything to do with the <laughs> fire at the witch hunter's barracks? No, not at all. We not were not. in the area. <laughs> I sorely regret not seeing that. Listen, you'll manage. Everybody believes Menga's missing. You can make up any story you want. My lads and me will lie in ambush in the ravine. Geralt will then join us and we'll await word from you. But how am I to contact you as Menga? Send word that the convoy's left. You'll need to figure that out. Come on, Guile's your middle name. So, we all clear? Dudu, get your ass to Temple Isle. <laughs> I'm off to assemble my crew. And we'll be waiting for you, Geralt. Yeah, see you in the ravine. Whoa, wait! Hold on! What happens after? I, I hope you don't expect me to continue as Menga, live like Chappelle, burning the occasional heretic to keep up appearances? No. Once it's over, we expect to see you at the Rosemary in time, where we'll all meet. To get pissed like wild badgers. So, settled, let's get to work. Sounds like a plan. You were marvelous. Not a single mistake. The performance in general, what did you think? I doubt the audience understood it all, but that's to be expected. I'm just pleased the Puffins got the word out. That was quite the crowd. You were right to cast Abelard as the prince. It's likely Maxim would have shown up drunk as a fish or forgotten about the premiere altogether. Well, we made a lot of good decisions, I guess. Your fee. I must admit your <laughs> style of mumming, well, it's quite minimalist. Did you study anywhere? No. At Kaer Morhen. <laughs> Minimum expression means maximum effect. Thanks for the coin. Take care now. All right. Well, that is awesome. Uh, and now we can go rescue uh, Dandelion. So that's going to be... That's gonna be loads of fun. And I got experience points. I have two experience points actually that we can spend, but we are gonna do that next time because we're gonna wrap it up here for uh, this episode. And uh, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much for tuning in. And if you do have enjoyed this video, <laughs> make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, if it's not your first time or your second time, Think about maybe becoming a member of the channel if you aren't already. And I will see you next time for more Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. As the, as the updates just keep rolling. In. <laughs> Have a great one, everybody. Bye for now.